how come you did that? You know, if first you don't succeed, destroy all the evidence that you even tried. <laughs> I've been reading Stephen Wright quotes. <laughs> guy's funny. Thank you, and the crowd went mild. That's correct, Wes. Yes, it's real. You know. Talk about brown sugar. Okay. <laughs> oh, well, they're doing all done and then they're doing all right. Down to New Orleans. We should have heard them around midnight. Brown sugar. How come you didn't? That, that, that's the name of this guitar. The fella who bought this, uh, uh, it was a special order because I think that brown sugar, it's, it's lacquered over and it's done so pretty, uh, it has to be the company. Uh, he also had a uh, engraved uh, truss rod cover and I've just kind of got rid of that. But anyway, this guitar is a Sweet 16, um, solid maple sides and back, solid spruce top. It's got a tone and a volume control, beautifully done, split block inlays, all bound, triple bound, three piece neck, or excuse me, five piece neck. And check out the neck on this, it's really pretty. See the neck on there? See? Oh, yeah, yeah, that is nice. And then it's nice body. It's got a couple, not too many uh, dings at all on it. By the way, I wanted to make a, one note about this 610. I always, when I get it, when I look for guitars, I always look for ones that don't have strap buttons. And that one didn't, and uh, because then it generally, uh, you know, you haven't taken it out and played out too much. So this guitar um, is a sweet sounding guitar. Let's, uh, I'm gonna turn off the, this here. Talk about it, man. So yeah, uh, this guitar, um, Uh, it's beautiful guitar, beautiful, beautiful. So uh, <clears throat> I can play it um, a jazz blues. Well, it, can you do Van Morrison's Moon Dance? Oh, sure, yeah, maybe. You want to kill the overhead? Yeah. Or, 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 or let's do this. Here's what it sounds like just by itself. It's pr again. Oh, that thing's loud too. It is loud. It's. They all have a their own little sound. I mean, even within style, within models, they all have their own little little tiny voice. Okay, so. I'm not a jukebox.
You know, if first you don't succeed, destroy all of the evidence that you even tried. <laughs> I've been reading Stephen Wright quotes. <laughs> Guy's funny. Um, you know, there's so many things to consider, like the body depth, the body size. I've been into 17 inches more than uh, 16 lately. And I mean lately, last three, three or four years, you know. So when I pick up a 16, uh, it just certainly feels different. Um, anyway, there it is. Sweet 16. Let's play. I want to. I wanted to play an original song. I'm gonna play, play Bossa Ro Bossa Rosa. Great. That was named by one of our students. And this is an original Bossa Nova song, right? That's correct, Wes. Yes, it's original. Uh, do you specifically want to play it on that guitar? I do. Okay, let's do it.
Thank you. And the crowd went mild. Anyway, that that thank you for listening to that and letting me indulge myself. Hi, Rich here again. I just wanted to say thanks for checking out my videos. If you like it, hit the thumbs up button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and sign up for those notifications so you can see all the cool guitar videos we put out each week. If you want more lessons right now, I have hundreds of them at guitarcollegelibrary.com. Check out our low price monthly streaming memberships. And if you want to learn jazz, check out my course, Jazz Guitar Improv. I take beginner jazz players and get them playing awesome solos on the fly. You'll see the link for the JGI course in the description below. Hey, thanks again for watching my channel. We'll see you again real soon with a new video.